Henry, I would like to thank you again for helping me wash my shirt, you know. I mean, it was very decent of you, I must say. Ed, it was my pleasure. What are friends for anyway? I always say. Oh, what a charming thing to, to have told me. I must remember that. But you see, if I could impose on you for just a hair longer, I have a bit of a problem. Because as you know, we've washed the shirt and it's very damp. But I mean, it's very sad to have to wear a damp shirt, I must say. But my problem is, how do I get it dry? Easy. No problem. I got my rope with me, and we just stretch out my rope, we put this shirt on it, and it'll get dry in no time. Oh, that's a very good scheme. You throw the rope down like there. Like so, like that, and do it like this. And I just place the shirt on it like so. See? Like that. Now let's go get something to eat. Yes. Wait a second. Uh, Henry, I, I, th I think, I, do I don't really think this is the right scheme, you know? Why not? Well, because, unless I'm mistaken, it seems that if the shirt is on the ground, it's going to be as soiled as it was earlier. Unless my train of thought is very off, which I don't think it is, I must say. No, I follow your train and it's right on the track. What we've got to do is tie the rope to something. Yes, but what? What? That's my question to you. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Wait, I've got it. We'll tie it to that tree over there. Oh, that's a very, very good scheme. Let me pick up the shirt, though. There you go. Yes. And I'll tie it right like a... You're just going to tie it there, then. Right there, and you'll put the, the shed on it. Then you and I'll be able to get some tea because I'm famished. Oh, I'm so hungry. I'm, I'm, the pain is still in my stomach from... Do yes. the honors, Ed. Very good. Ah. Oh. Yes. There. Oh, dear. Wait a second. This isn't working out at all. Everything's gone sour as sour can be, you know. What do you do now? Who do you phone? I'm at a total loss, Henry. Hmm. We'll have to tie the rope to something else. Yes, good idea. But what? What? What, I ask you? Ah! Wait, Ed, I've got it over here. What? Oh, right yeah. there. See? Hands up. Oh, there this, you go. This is a very intelligent scheme, sure, Henry. Sure, I'll just tie it right to you like that. Oh. And we put the shirt right in the middle. Are you clever or what? Put it right there. Yes. Sun will dry it in no time oh, at all. And I was concerned. Foolish me. See? Let's go get something to eat. Good idea, because I'm... I say I'm very hungry. Come on, Ed. I'm, well, I, I see... Seem to be trapped. Oh, I see what the problem is. I'm tied to the tree, you know. Well, that's very sad in a way, I must say. I suppose I'll just have to stand here and wait till the shirt is very dry, I must say. I didn't mean for it to go sour, Ed. I mean, when I tied it to you and to the tree and you tried, I called you and you went to go and you, you couldn't go because she was tied. Um, I just wrecked everything I wanted to eat with you and I, I don't like eating alone and I wanted you to be with me. Well, no, no need for you to sob so, Henry. Perhaps, possibly, a new scheme is in order. What the what? Wait, Ed, I've got it. I've got it, I'm gonna tie this to something else. Oh, well, are you a genius or what? Please answer me that, because how could you have thought of that? That's one of the best ideas, I thank you. I See thank that? you very much, you know. Look at that, Ed. Oh. I tie it like this. And now, we can both get something to eat. Oh, but wait. Before you go, I just, I'd like to take this opportunity to say to you that you have quite an amazing brain, you know. And it's been very decent of you to use it on my behalf, I must say. Ed, it's always a pleasure to help my best friend, I always say. Oh. Mm -hmm.